Always alerting, always tracking. This is Next Weather. And many people hoping for a great Veterans Day here at home, Dave, but that'll be seen through the end of the week. Good weather. Yes, so maybe by the end of the week, uh, nice and comfortable, cooler temperatures, lower humidity. Still have to do work around a few showers tomorrow, so keep an eye on the Next Weather Radar Network. Uh, the set starts tomorrow morning. Get your day started with that. Uh, there could be a little activity around as these uh, showers continue to work their way through the area here tonight. Lining right up near the coast, uh, they will be pushing through the area and moving inland with the breeze. Uh, so we'll keep that going overnight tonight. Could wake up to just a few showers around tomorrow morning. But right now you could just hear a little rain shower here in Miami Beach, Aventura, just south of Fort Lauderdale. Everything will move uh, with that breeze going east to west. Could be a little calmer tomorrow. That will allow the temperatures to start to really heat up here. We're in the mid 70s tonight. The east wind will keep it mostly steady here. Uh, maybe mid to upper 70s by the time you wake up tomorrow morning. We're at 78 right now. We had that breeze coming in from the northeast. And again, not too long from now, we'll see a shower pass right through here from right to left uh, with that breeze. Keep the breeze around tomorrow. There's the tropical moisture here just trying to push into the area. So we'll put those rain showers in and they'll work their way through. Push to the interior by the afternoon, keeping it pretty warm at least Tuesday and Wednesday. If we look up to the north, we'll have a front coming through uh, by Thursday and Friday. The wind picks up. You get isolated rain showers at least by the end of the week. But even drier air comes in uh, by Friday night and Saturday. And look at that wind turning a bit to the north. Typically, when you see that uh, wind coming together right off the coast, that allows some cooler air to make it here into South Florida. And that will be by next weekend. Of course, also by that time, uh, we're keeping an eye on the tropics. Rafael is done. The last advisory was issued. Uh, but at the same time, another outlook area uh, for the Western Caribbean. Typically, we see them the storms develop in this area this time of year low development potential. Anything that does develop with the next weather tropics tracker, it's showing it uh, there by the end of the week and next weekend. Of course, we have this big area of high pressure just to our north here. So anything that tries to move north will encounter a lot of wind shear here. Likely that will keep everything to the south. No alerts in the Atlantic waters, lighter breeze tomorrow, calmer conditions, northeast wind at 10 knots there. No alerts in the Keys. You wake up tomorrow morning to a few showers around and we'll see them coming through the area in the afternoon and evening as we up those rain chances here uh, just a bit. Next weather seven day forecast. We have warm temperatures Monday and Tuesday. There we are into the mid to upper 80s. Then we drop things Wednesday, Thursday. We're down to 82. Lower the rain chances. In fact, take them out of the forecast by the end of the week and the weekend. And look at our low temperatures dropping in the upper 60s Saturday and Sunday. Mm, that's the temperatures I like. Dave, thank you.